All right, I'm just here with Frank here. We're gonna talk about dumbbell bench pressing. This is why I like to spot at the wrists and not at the elbows when I'm doing a dumbbell press. So you go down into your position here when you're doing your reps. So he's gonna press it up like this. Let's say that he's getting stuck at the bottom or something like that. A lot of people, when they're down there, they'll hold right here. If I was to press right here, that leaves his forearms completely wide open, and so those weights can topple, they can tip because there's no support through those forearms. So I like to hold on to the wrist, something like this. I'll even have my thumb on the back of the hand so that I can really guide that weight up. A lot of people will start asking whether or not this is enough force that I can apply because I'm holding on to the wrists. And the answer is, yes it is. If I'm applying more than 10, 15, 20 pounds of additional help at that wrist, which most spotters can apply, that's more than enough help. If they need more than that, the weight's probably too heavy for them in the first place and they shouldn't be lifting it. So that's my rationale. That's why I like to spot the wrist. It's a lot safer. It's a lot better option for people when they're doing dumbbell presses, whether it's an overhead press or whether it's a bench press. That's it.